time now for your Sunday money. The past week was America Saves Week, which is a call to action for Americans to commit to saving successfully. So in honor of this event, our certified financial planner Suzanne Himes is here with some tips and strategies for our own savings goals. Now, it should be easy to save, <laughs> but sometimes unexpected events get in the way and there goes your little, your little nest That's egg. That's right, it's all out the window, right? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so I think life often challenges us to confirm and reaffirm our financial priorities. And so, uh, you know, it's just, it's important to have some guidelines in place. I call them personal financial policies. Okay. Can be very helpful. Uh, so some examples of that would be, you know, let's say, um, you know, every time you get a new car, yeah. you're gonna not have a car loan longer than four years. Mm, that would okay. be, you decide that in advance or replacing the cell phone, you know, you're gonna keep it at least three years. Um, so just thinking, you know, and of course, if you're on your own, this is just something you're gonna decide. If you have a partner, mm -hmm. you know, thinking ahead, what are you gonna do, you know, with additional savings, for example. You know, we often say, save, you should save 50% of any new money. Mm -hmm. But a policy would say, I will save 50% of any new money for the coming year or two years. And so it just, you know, it just helps you keep on track yeah, to Kind of like goals. rules for yourself. That yeah, exactly, you make, like, exactly. What other yeah. things can you do to, to kind of help keep yourself in that, that good path? <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, you know, basics are tried and true and, you know, they're not, they're not necessarily exciting, but they do work. So have specific goals for the savings. I think it's much easier to uh, keep on track if you can visualize, you know, what's the purpose of that money. Again, automate savings as much as possible. Pay yourself first, you know, you won't, you won't spend it maybe if you don't see it, that kind of thing. Um, and also I think it can be very helpful to have a savings buddy. So if you've got a mm -hmm. particular goal and you think you might be struggling to reach that goal, you know, a friend, a coworker, you know, just somebody that you, you know, want to communicate that goal with. And of course it can be mutual, they might have a goal too, but someone to, you know, touch base with you, hold you a little bit accountable, see how it's going. You can talk through not only core struggles, but celebrate when you mm -hmm. reach that goal. I think that's fun. And that's actually uh, one of the key parts of the America Saves Pledge, uh, that whole America Saves Week was accountability. Yeah. You know, uh, just having periodic reminders, how are you doing, how's it going? Um, a couple other things, uh, quickly just, um, uh, make sure you have an emergency fund in place, otherwise mm -hmm. all your other goals can be quickly thrown yeah. off track. Um, these are a lot of these are, I yeah. think people think short term, yeah. um, because like, and especially young people like saving for a vacation or a car and this, but yeah. like thinking the long term picture too, as you said, the emergency fund for yeah. things that could happen later down the road or bigger purchases or bigger needs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And again, with long term savings, you know, it's not just putting the money aside, but what are you going to do with it? Mm -hmm. So I think it's very powerful to take advantage of tax uh, free growth mm -hmm. on that mm -hmm. money. So in addition to your uh, re typical employer retirement plans, think about, you know, are you saving for education? Think about a 529 plan. Yeah. Uh, if you're saving for retirement, also think about a Roth IRA. Uh, if you're saving for future long-term health uh, healthcare expenses, mm -hmm. think about a health savings account if you can. So putting that money to work and make sure, again, for longer term, you know, long time horizons, make yeah. sure you're investing uh, for some growth to mm -hmm. keep up with inflation, to keep the purchasing power of that savings yeah. working for you. Lots of so. different things to think about. Yeah. Suzanne, thank you. Yeah. Of course, you can yeah. always reach out to a financial yeah. advisor if you need help kind of navigating that yeah. as well. Absolutely.